Let's give it a try. <clears throat> CQ, 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 calling CQ 40 meters. CQ, 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 calling CQ 40 meters. CQ, CQ, CQ 40, calling CQ 40 on a two foot high end fed half wave. CQ, CQ, CQ 40, CQ 40, from a two foot high end fed half wave in mid Michigan. This is November 8, November Kilo. November 8, November Kilo. Listening. CQ, 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 calling CQ, 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 calling CQ 40 meters, CQ, 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 calling CQ 40, CQ, CQ, CQ 40 from a two foot high end fed half wave, CQ, CQ from a two foot high end fed half wave antenna in mid Michigan, this is November 8, November Kilo. November 8th, November Kilo, listening. CQ, 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 calling CQ, 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 calling CQ 40 meters. CQ, CQ, CQ 40, calling CQ, CQ from a two foot high end fed half wave antenna. Two foot high above the ground from mid Michigan. This is November 8th, November Kilo. November 8th, November Kilo. Listening. CQ, 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 calling CQ 40, CQ, CQ 40, calling CQ, CQ, CQ 40 meters using a two foot high end fed half wave antenna, calling CQ, 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 calling CQ 40, using a two foot high end fed. This is November 8, November Kilo, November 8, November Kilo, listening. CQ, 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 calling CQ 40, CQ, CQ 40, calling CQ, CQ 40 meters using a two foot high end fed half wave. CQ, CQ, CQ 40, calling CQ 40 using a two foot high end fed. This is November 8, November Kilo. November 8, November Kilo. Listening. <laughs> I kind of feel silly doing that. Thought I heard someone. Huh? QSL, November 8, November Kilo. November 8, November Kilo. Yeah, QSL, I've got a nice copy on you. Uh, this antenna is a little noisy, um, and I didn't get to see my S meter because I'm recording the QSL, if you don't mind, for YouTube. Um, but I believe you're running, I believe I saw an S4 or S5. QSL? Okay, yeah, very good. Uh, November 8, November Kilo, with Delta Zero Tango. Well, I, you know, I didn't, it got dark, so I couldn't tell how high the lake was, but uh, 
the uh, other ham that was helping me said they were uh, look pretty good. So not sure how high they are in the end. It's running over uh, kind of a swamp. <laughs> I was out walking through the swamp, but it was about a foot deep of water. So uh, eventually I'm going to get it up higher, set an open wire line and a dinner on to her. We were we were killed. The name of Todd came off here, Delta Delta, and uh, South Dakota, and he's MK, but he's all the zero tank. Yeah, it's a little bit of a long story, but it's okay. Very good, Todd. Whiskey Delta Zero Tango from November 8, November Kilo. Real good, Todd. Solid copy. Solid copy. A little bit of QSB at times. A little QSB. But then again, um, I'm only using uh, a two-foot high-end bed antenna. Uh, your antenna, Todd, is a little better than mine. Just a little better than mine. Um, I'm just playing around just screwing around and decided to uh, put up a 40 meter end fed wire on bamboo sticks two feet off the ground Todd. Uh, one moment I'm going to switch to my dipole just a moment. Okay Todd uh, I'm on my dipole and an inverted V dipole with the apex at about 26 feet about 26 feet at the apex I wonder if you can um, I wonder if you're copying me a little better now than on the two foot high end bed. Over. November eight, November kilo whiskey delta zero taking a little bit better. Um, you're about S four, about S four. You're about S three. The other one. I get the switch back and forth quickly and uh, switch back and forth quickly. Give me the EP that way. Over. Okay. Very good, Todd. Very good. I'm using the inverted V. Using the inverted V. One, two, three on the inverted V. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three on a two foot high end fed antenna. Uh, one, two, three on a two foot high end fed. One, two, three, one, two, three on the dipole. Yeah, well, on, the, on the quick switch, the dipole uh, is about uh, one SU and better. <laughs> yeah, no kidding, Todd. Uh, uh, amazing is a, <laughs> that's one way to put it. I'm shocked. Uh, I, I put the wire up yesterday just wanting to play around and make a YouTube video. And I came in and um, I had to trim a foot and a half off to get a perfect match. Um, so having dropped it down from about 16 feet to 2 feet, I had to trim a foot and a half off the wire, but the first contact I made was with a OL725PLZ in the Czech Republic. QSO? I, I November. Hey, November, kill a whiskey delta zero tank. You're kidding me. The first contact was Oscar Lima? <laughs> yeah, yep, Oscar Lima 725PLZ, like in please. I was shocked. I was, I'm a CWQRPer at heart, but uh, um, I decided to give him a call using 100 watts on my two footer, and he heard me over. That, that is crazy. <laughs> that is crazy. So it's just, uh, it's just one thing after another. Like I said, okay, so you're feeding it in the shack and then out and just, just two foot off the ground. Is that right? Yeah, QSL, QSL. Um, Todd, I use multi-tap onions, which I've um, kind of concocted here, and I have I have a seven-tap onion right next to me, uh, hanging on the windowsill, and clipped to the uh, sixty-four to one tap on my onion is a sixty-one. I'm sorry, a sixty-one and a half foot wire. So I've got a piece of speaker wire, sixty-one and a half feet long clipped onto the uh, 64 to 1 tap and it goes out my shack window at a height of 6 feet and just goes across the yard on the top of bamboo sticks at about 2 feet high. Over. I think the dipole is a little better, as it should be, really. Um, 
it all based on the height advantage there. Um, that is, I, I'm almost speechless because I, I wouldn't even expect to hear you on that 40 uh, NFED. So that's a halfway to NFED, so I am beat 60, you said 64 to 1. So you're up around 3,000 ohms approximately then. Yeah, uh-huh, QSL, yep, QSL. On my 80 meter end pad, it's an even higher impedance wire. It's about 4 kilo ohms, and uh, I use an 81 to 1 tap on that wire. Um, it just so happened that uh, when I dropped this speaker wire down to 2 feet above ground level, uh, the impedance dropped from about 4K to 3K. And so just dropping down one tap, I was able to achieve a per near perfect match. Um, Todd, I'm, I've got, if you want to see this QSO, um, I'm going to have this QSO on YouTube in about an hour, with your permission, if you want to watch QSO. Oh, Roger, you don't deserve that. Yep, you, uh, yeah, you have my permission, no problem. Uh, yeah, I will uh, do that. I'd like to, uh, I don't know if you're still recording or... Okay, very good, Todd. Um, you sound a lot louder on the dipole. You're only about a, um, at times, 1S unit louder on the dipole. Um, there were moments there where you were equal on both antennas, but even when your signal strength is equal on the two, the dipole just sounds a lot louder to me. Over. Okay, um, now uh, I guess I have to play with it. Plus, I need to replace the vocal wire. 
WD0T from NANK. No, Todd, you didn't get my name. I got uh, I got so excited I forgot to tell you. Uh, my name is Chuck. Charlie Hotel Uniform Charlie Kilo. Name is Chuck, and I'm uh, I'm about an hour north of Detroit. Um, about an hour north, an hour and a half north of Detroit, Michigan. And the rig is a Yesu FT DX3000, Todd. So, I must get running, Todd. I really, really, really enjoyed this QSO with you. Uh, I love talking about antennas. I love hearing hams talk about their antennas. And um, it was very, very fun. Uh, and a little surprising, Todd. Um, your antenna work sounds fantastic. Very, very, very fun. Um, so, Todd. I wish you 73. I bid you 73 from the dipole. And now I bid you 73, old man, from two, two feet above ground level. 73, Todd, from two feet above the ground from November 8, November Kilo. Over. Yeah, Todd, if you just look for my call sign, you'll find me. Um, my channel name is just N-A-N-K-Q-R-P. Okay, N-A-N-K-Q-R-P. And I just started posting videos to share with my brother, Art, who lives down in Ohio. So, uh, Todd, in one hour, your video will be on YouTube. So thanks for the cue, so old man, 73. Okay, 73. Thanks for that, Chuck, and uh, good job there with the antenna. Uh, N-E-N-K-W-D-0-T-73. 73. 73. <laughs> uh, we're on an angle again, I see. There you go. A nice 20-minute uh, rag chew. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Um, I think I've done it all <laughs> I'm getting choked up. I think I've done it about all now. I've contacted uh, an OL7.